In this video, we're going to be solving a system of equations by graphing. In 1, it says solve each system by graphing. In A, we have L1 is y plus 2x is equal to 3, and L2 is x minus 3 is equal to y. So we want to graph both of these lines and find where they intersect. So for line 1, I'm going to plug in x is equal to 0, and I have y plus 2 times 0 is equal to 3. So y is equal to 3, which means one point on this line is 0, 3. And then we're going to plug in x is equal to 1. So we have y plus 2 times 1 is equal to 3. So y is equal to 1. So the point 1, 1 is on this line. So now let's graph L1. So we have the point 0, 3, and 1, 1. And now I'm going to draw a line through these two points. And now that we have L1 drawn, I'm going to go ahead and mark it L1. And now we're going to find some points for L2 and graph that. So we have, if x is equal to 0, then we have 0 minus 3 is equal to y. So y is equal to negative 3. So we have the point 0, negative 3, and if y is equal to 0, then we have x minus 3 is equal to 0, so x is equal to 3, so we have the point 3, 0. So now let's plot these two points. We have 0, negative 3, and 3, 0, and now we're going to draw a line through those two points. And now that we have L2 drawn, I'm going to label it L2. And if we take a look at the graph, the solution is where the two lines intersect, which is right here at 2, negative 1. And now they ask us, are the slopes equal? And the slopes are not equal. We can see that we have a positive slope for L2 and a negative slope for L1, so we're going to say no. And then they ask, how many solutions are there? And we have one solution. And the solution is 2, negative 1. In B, we have L1 is equal to 2y is equal to 4. And L2, y is equal to negative 3. So for L1, if we divide both sides by 2, we have y is equal to 2, which is a horizontal line. And for L2, we have y is equal to negative 3. So we have two horizontal lines. So we're going to draw a horizontal line at y is equal to 2 and y is equal to negative 3. And now that both lines are drawn, I'm going to label them. So our green line is L1, y is equal to 2, and our blue line is L2. And the first thing they want to know is, are the lines parallel? And yes, they're parallel. We have two horizontal lines. And then they ask, are the slopes the same? And the answer is yes. If they're parallel, the slopes are the same. And now they say, are the y-intercepts equal? And the answer is no. The y-intercept for L1 was 2, and for L2, it's negative 3. So now they ask, how many solutions are there? And there are no solutions, so we'll say none. These two parallel lines don't intersect anywhere, so we have no solution. In C, we have the lines L1, is negative 5x plus 3y is equal to negative 9. And L2, we have 5 thirds x minus 3 is equal to y. So if I was to solve L1 for y, I would have negative 5x plus 3y is equal to negative 9. I'm going to add 5x to both sides. So I have 3y is equal to 5x minus 9, and now I'm going to divide both sides by 3, and I get y is equal to 5 thirds x minus 3. And now we can see that L1 is exactly the same as L2, because L2 is y is equal to 5 thirds x minus 3. So we have the same line. So we need to pick two points, so I'm going to choose x is equal to 0, and we'd have y is equal to 5 thirds times 0 minus 3, which is equal to negative 3. So one point is 0, 
negative 3. And then I'm going to choose x is equal to 3. So I have y is equal to 5 thirds times 3 minus 3. And 5 thirds times 3 is 5. 5 minus 3 is 2. So y is equal to 2, which means another point is 3, 2. So now I'm going to plot my two points and graph the lines. So we have 0, negative 3 and 3, 2. And now I'm going to draw a line. And this line here is L1 and L2. So we have two of the same lines and they ask us are the slopes equal? And the answer is yes. The slopes were both 5 thirds. And are the y-intercepts equal? The answer is yes. The y-intercept was negative 3 for both lines. And now it asks how many solutions are there? And we can say an infinite amount. Because the lines are the same, any solution is going to be the same for both lines. And now they give us a box that goes through everything we just saw in the three examples. If the lines intersect, then we have one unique solution, and the slopes are not equal. If we have parallel lines, then there's no solution, and the slopes are equal, and the y-intercept is different. And if we have coinciding lines, then we have an infinite number of solutions. Our slope is equal and our y-intercept is equal. And that's all for this video on solving a system of equations by graphing.